everybody and welcome back to my channel today i thought well actually this week i thought we could kind of just do like a weekly vlog i really enjoyed doing like weekly vlogs it was quite a while ago now but i did two weekly vlogs um when i had all the new carpets and stuff fitted in the house and i just thought you know what i really fancy doing a weekly vlog because i just think that they are so fun and i have been watching james and karis recently as well with their weekly vlogs and just made me really feel like i should film a weekly vlog and I thought it would be nice for you guys to kind of just come along with me in the week. As you know, I like to do that sort of stuff. I love a vlog. And I always just feel like they're a little bit more like... You get to see like a little bit more of like the realistic sort of side, I guess, of just life uh, in general. But I just thought, you know, we could just do a nice long weekly vlog. Week's vlog, just you guys with me. Me with you. Just how it is. So I've just put on a bit of makeup. I haven't put loads on. I've put... The, um, I've got the Iconic Lip Oil. Now, I've had this since, I think, my birthday. And I absolutely adore it. I put it on every single morning once I've finished. So, I think this colour is She's a Peach. Absolutely love it. Obviously, as you can tell, I've used quite a lot. But it's honestly amazing. And then I'm using the Iconic um, Mascara as well, which I was using Smashbox. Um, I think I might even have it, I don't, oh no, I don't have it in here, I've popped it away. Um, I was using the Iconic Mascara, um, the Smashbox Mascara, and basically it was like kind of coming down, I never had this problem with it for such a long time because I've been using it for a while now, um, and it was like coming down like here under my eye, and I was just like that's really annoying, so I've decided that I'm going to spice it up a little bit, and I've been using the Iconic Mascara for a couple of weeks and stuff now, a few weeks now, and I, I'm loving it, it's so easy to take off at night time. And it just, the brush is so nice, it's not like really thick, and it's like a really, really nice feel on my eyelashes, and I just love it, and I feel like they look a little bit longer, and they just feel really good. And then obviously I've just popped a little bit of concealer on. I do my skincare in the morning now, like as soon as I wake up, so I get up, I brush my teeth, and I do my skincare straight away in the morning, just because it gives it time to soak in, and I just prefer that because... It's easier for me to put my makeup on and it, it just kind of looks better that way. So yeah, I've decided to just go for an all natural sort of look today. It's actually not a bad day outside, to be honest. I don't think that it's kind of like a little bit sunny, but it's kind of cloudy. But I'm hoping that the blue skies will sort of kind of take over. They are on this side. I don't know if you guys can see very well over here. They are on this side, they're kind of like starting to come through. Which I'm very excited about because I just love a bit of sun and it kind of makes me feel really springy and like ready for nicer weather and happier sort of like, honestly, I think the weather has so much to do with a lot of people's moods and everything. Like the sun just makes everyone so happy. And I always feel like that whenever I'm like out working or anything like that. Everybody just looks so like, feels like so much joy <laughs> when that happens. But I just wanted to quickly show you my outfit as well. Because I have found a new obsession with wearing my Hollister, um, like I think they're like curvy sort of mum jeans. And I absolutely love them. So I rolled them up at the bottom because they are a little bit too big for me. Um, and I just feel like they are honestly so comfortable. I have to wear a belt just because they're a tiny little bit baggy and like it's not super baggy but it's enough to like kind of irritate me a little bit so I then I just thought I'd go with this H&M sort of cropped jumper and I just feel like it's such a vibe and you guys know me I don't even know why I show you my slippers every time you know I'm wearing them I have the messiest bedroom and I have to tackle it I'm gonna just brave it and show you I mean look at all of these clothes I know that it's not on the floor or anything I try not to dump clothes on the floor but the sofa then becomes the dumping ground. And I've got shoes to put away. I've got things I'm getting rid of. This is like literally a whole basket of clothes and like loads of stuff. And there's like things I need to put away in the attic and <sighs> so annoying. I have to change my bed sheets as well. I want to do that today. So I thought, yeah, you know, I've got a few things and that to do. I plan on having like a um date night as well with Josh for Friday so I've got some really like good ideas for that and I thought that I could take you along with me whilst I set up for that and everything I thought that would be really really fun so yeah I've got like plans in my head for like a I've been looking on Pinterest for like a obviously I have my van it's like a movie night in the back of my van with like fairy lights and duvets and pillows and like get like food 
get my laptop all like ready with movies on and do you know what I mean I just feel like it's gonna be a vibe so I plan on doing that and surprising him with that on Friday because we already said Friday was gonna be our date night so that's what I was planning anyway so I'm gonna pop some perfume on now I do have to go to work but I will catch up with you guys later because I want to show you the cookies that my mum has made they are literally the best things in the whole entire world they are like double chop chip or something I think that's what they are not triple I think they're double honestly it was just like a little bit of heaven I was eating yes i will catch up with you guys in a bit when i'm back home and everything so i can uh, show you those i'm literally so excited to show you because they are so amazing what are you doing hi oh hi hello oh thank you ah, hi let's go show everybody how sunny it is Look everybody, how nice is this weather? Oh my gosh, the sun is shining. We are all happy. We're outside. Say hi everybody. Hi everybody. <laughs> I've just got home. Um, just let the dogs out. It's so nice outside, so I'm gonna leave the door open. A little bit of fresh air in the house. I think I'm gonna get the tortoise as well and pop her in the garden for a little bit because I think that she might enjoy a little bit of sunshine. I've just got back obviously from work. I'm gonna I'm really need I'm definitely gonna go to the toilet. Um and also make some lunch because mum will be back in a bit. But I wanted to show you those incredible cookies that she made. Honestly, guys, these are like a whole new level of yum. Look at all of these cookies. Oh my gosh, just look how perfect they look. Oh my days, honestly. The most perfect cookies in all of the cookie land. <laughs> but also, I got a delivery from, I ordered some protein bars from my protein because I really wanted some to snack on whilst I'm at work. And I just thought it'd be nice to have ones from there because I ordered like a sample box from my protein which I've had this stuff before but um I really wanted like to find my new like protein bar if you know what I mean so I have been searching and searching and I ordered these because honestly guys these are like so good I had one of these from the box. I've also had the bulk powders. Well, I mean, they're just bulk now. But the bulk, like, brownies. And they are so good. The only thing is, is that they're a little bit more expensive than these ones. However, these ones basically exactly the same. They taste pretty much exactly the same. I picked up the baked cookies and I just honestly these are so tasty and I thought these would be good as well if I wanted to like maybe before a workout or something just open it up and I ordered a box of I think it was like 16 or something let me count sorry a box of 12 and it obviously comes in the box and it comes as a proper big cookie and I love these these are just so tasty now they are 13 grams of protein, which I thought was really good for obviously a cookie. And they are just so, so yummy. So I thought, you know what, I'm gonna pick up a box of those. And I got them in the uh, double chocolate as well. And they're just so tasty. So I picked up some of those, which I'm really happy about. However, I am gonna have one of mum's cookies because they're just so good. Honestly, cookies in a bit of sunshine. Will that help you? Now the grass does need to be cut, but look. Ay, 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 what are you doing? You can't chase the bees. That's not fair. That's not fair, is it? <laughs> but all the bees are out. And it's really starting to feel like spring. Like I saw a butterfly today as well. And I haven't seen a butterfly in ages, like months, I'm talking. These do follow me everywhere I go. <laughs> I have gone outside and back in and they're following me everywhere. <laughs> it's okay. And it was so beautiful and I keep seeing all the bees and that about. And it makes me so happy because I love seeing bees. And I love bees having like 
flowers in our garden so like i love seeing them on there it just filled my heart with so much joy <laughs> i don't know why but oh wow but i'm gonna make some lunch as well and i've got to, we've got to get james from school today obviously get to school every day <laughs> have some lunch I'm not sure what i'm going to make for lunch yet i haven't quite decided maybe something oven based i have something i can cook in the oven with like maybe some like rice or something i'll see what we've got we'll go through what we have honestly i've got so many good ideas for date night on friday you guys i'm not even ready to see what i've got planned it's gonna be so good but I will catch up with you guys in a bit. I was searching for the dog and I didn't know where it was and I walked out into the garden to find it. Just to turn around and see this. Hello. Are you okay? Oh, lovely. Hello guys. So it is now the next day. I have just got back from work. It's actually a really good day today. I finished nice and early. Because I had a really quiet day, which was great. I've got back and mum is going to be back shortly anyway as well. But I just needed to show you these brownies that she made this morning because she's been on a mission this week. I don't know where this red mark has come from. But she's been on a mission this week of like baking stuff. Let me just show you these. I'm sorry, but if that's not a gooey brownie, then I mean, I don't know what is. Look at the goo on that. Oh my word as you can see we've already had one this morning um which obviously just made my day <laughs> but i just wanted to show you because i have been obviously planning out um mine and josh's date night and honestly guys i think i've outdone myself i'm pretty proud of myself with what i've come up with and all of the things i've kind of planned so i'm just gonna get them up on the laptop so i can show you because honestly, I've got a list on my phone and everything, of all the things that I need as well, and that I want to have. So I just wanted to quickly show you what I have made, which I made these on Photoshop, because obviously I have that, um, because that's the best thing for my thumbnails, to put everything together. So um, obviously I've gone for like a bit of a cute hairstyle today. I've got like a big clip in the back. I don't know if you guys can see it that well. But I've got a clip in the back of my hair and everything. I haven't worn a big clip like that. I mean, I wouldn't say it's big, but I haven't worn a clip like that in such a long time. So I thought, you know what? Let's just go with it. So, first off, I have created, like, um, tickets. So I thought that was really cute. So I put some, like, um, film sort of reel on the sides. Um, I put an actual reel fizzy drink and then popcorn so it's movie night admit one pad ticket and then obviously the date which i thought was just so cute i've gone for sort of like a gray theme as well and then i also wrote out a note so it's welcome to movie night um and then i put josh you've been invited to join shannon for a movie night under the stars there are four different films to pick from and each are in one of the envelope please choose your film and make your way to the van to join your date which i thought was really cute so i put like a clapperboard and i like faded it in the background so i just thought that looked so cool i was very proud of myself and then i've gone for just a small one so it's welcome to room one and i'm going to put that on the back of the van because i'm going to kit the van out for date night and it's going to be so freaking cute honestly i'm so proud of myself for what i have like done so far i feel like i'm really do outdoing myself now let me go through my list with you guys of what i like want to do so i plan on having fairy lights duvets pillows snacks i want an ice bucket because i want to put some drinks in there because what i plan on doing is where we are is quite like there's sort of a secluded kind of bit by the side so we can be in the van but not have to go somewhere if that makes sense like it will be like date night and stuff and then it means that we can have a drink and everything like that i need to download movies on the laptop um and then i have done the so I've done obviously the invitation, the tickets and the room number. So I just need to print those off. I need to get some ink and print those off. Um, I also want to do like a snack box. So I need to pop to like Morrison's I think. 
and get all the snacks that we want. Um, and then also I want to do a takeaway. So what I was planning on doing is maybe like a Waggers or something, Wagger Mama and order it to where Josh works so he can pick it up before he comes back. Um, and then we can kind of have like dinner together in the van. Guys, it's gonna be good, okay? I've got all of these plans. And let me just show you like all the ones I've got on Pinterest so far. This sort of vibe, I don't, so I've got my like Pinterest board, which is obviously date night. And I've kind of like put these sort of ones on it here. And this is the kind of vibe I want to go for. Oh, I thought I'd saved way more than that. But anyway, this kind of vibe, you know, a real cute van. I'm going for like under the stars. Obviously it's still cold and I think it's meant to be raining. So I'm going to do under the stars for like putting fairy lights on the like roof of the van so inside and I've got some actual star lights in my bedroom so I'm gonna get that and some fairy lights so I'm gonna just literally fairy light everything and put fairy lights everywhere which I'm really excited about because I think it's just gonna look so cute and yeah I'm just so excited about it I feel like I really like I've gone in depth and planned for this one so I just feel like we both need a real like good date night do you know what I mean? So anyway, that's what I'm all excited about. So I literally couldn't sleep about it. And I woke up really early this morning. I was just like, ah, just stop. I get so like invested in that sort of stuff that like sometimes I upset my sleep and everything like that. So I will catch up with you guys in a bit. I hope you're all doing well. Um, thank you so much for watching my videos. You guys always mean the world to me and I'm very, very grateful for you all. And I will speak to you guys soon. Hello everybody, I have just got back from the shop, I'm picking James up from school and I just thought I'd run through with you guys what I picked up from the shop because I picked up a lot of stuff which I thought was really good value for what I got and like I'm really chuffed for myself because I basically got everything I needed. So let me run through with you guys what I picked up. So in the pound shop I picked up a couple of cotton wool pads, um, packs of those because I've run out recently and I use these obviously for my skincare, uh, especially getting my makeup off because I use my cleansing stick and then I use these to get it off and then afterwards I use my tonic, which I use for this. Honestly guys, I keep getting these little red marks on my face. I don't know where this has come from, I think I must have scratched my face or something. But anyway, so I picked those up. Um, I also picked up some... Um, Envelopes. Now these are cards and envelopes, so I thought I could use these because obviously, as you guys would have seen earlier, I have picked um, obviously for the invitation for my date night. Um, I need to do four envelopes with four different films, so I thought these would be really cute. And obviously, these were just a pound, so and I thought little brown ones, super duper cute. And then it will obviously have like option one, option two, option three, and option four, and it will be a bit of a surprise. So whatever one he picks you know, we'll be watching. <laughs> so I also picked up these super cute lights, which are normally a pound, but they were on offer for 50p each. I just thought that these were adorable. Now, look at those. I thought they were so cute. And this is what they look like, obviously, when they are up. So I picked up four of those and they're literally just battery powered. And I think they need only two batteries. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna need all of them, but I thought if I get them all then, you know, I have enough if I need them. Next, I picked up these like sticky rollers. Now, I don't know where mine's gone, which I got for my scrapbooks, but I have been stressing out because I can't find it. And I literally just found one and I'm so annoyed, but I'm glad I've got these because now I have a couple which I can obviously use. Now I picked up a bucket. Now I know it's not very small, but I've been one, I obviously said to you guys earlier, on my desk I needed a nice bucket and I didn't want to go I looked on Amazon and they were like seven or eight pounds and I was like oh okay I'm not really gonna like probably use it very often so it was like oh I don't really want to buy like a proper one yet I'd love to have like a proper ice bucket obviously um maybe when I move out that sort of thing but right now I don't use it very often so I would like just a normal bucket maybe so I thought this was only a pound and pick up a bucket it's got a little handle so it's gonna be really easy to like carry about and I thought I'll get a bag of ice put that in there put like maybe a bottle of wine or something that sort of thing maybe in there from Morrison's I picked up oh my gosh 
this is not for date night but i picked up some tulips because my flowers i don't know if you guys can see oh my god i've got bottles everywhere just please like ignore them <laughs> Um, my flowers are basically dead so I picked up some tulips they were only three pounds and I thought they were such a beautiful springy sort of color so oh they smell amazing oh, and they just look so pretty so I thought I'm going to change those over in a minute and put those ones in the bin and also swap them over to these ones because I feel like they're just so cute it's such a vibe and they go with my candle and everything um next I picked up oh also I picked these up from the pound shop I forgot to show you these I forgot they were in there. I picked up these little heart-shaped plates and I thought, oh, they are just the cutest thing. Now I was thinking maybe we could either have dinner on those or I could make some cookies and put that on there. I'm going all out, guys, for this date night, okay? I mean, I'm, I hope Josh likes it and appreciates it because I'm going all out and it's going to look so cute. You guys aren't even ready to see it later on in the week. Um, I picked up some Bonneville fingers for me because these are my pride and joy. I absolutely love them so much. They are my favorite thing. When I heard that they were coming out with Bonneville fingers, I was literally felt a little bit like I should cry kind of inside because it was just such a great thing. These are incredible. They taste so good. Um, I also picked up some chili heatwave doritos and some mild salsa because i thought i love this and i really fancied it when i saw it i was like i just need a little bit of salsa you know doritos and dip in my life so here we are with doritos and dip salsa is the way to go and then i picked up josh some um, sweet and salt popcorn because he really likes sweet and salted and that's like his preferred popcorn and I thought that Cassie likes that one so I've gone for that popcorn because obviously it's everything I really needed I literally cannot wait to go through it with you guys when we obviously actually have date night but I'm going to put snacks in there and then I'm going to put everything I need also snacks in that, in that bag envelope in there those can go in oh, and I'm gonna pop these just over on my bed for a minute I've actually had such a nice day we sat down and we had lunch had some brownies and cookies we also watched Ugly Betty which you guys know that we have started watching again we're obsessed and we were like oh, we should probably go out because it makes you feel a little bit better I felt a little bit sluggish and so did mum so we were like let's go out and let's just do a little bit of shopping for things that I needed to get. I feel better now I've got them. And I'm really excited for Friday. But yeah, so I'm gonna pop these in my vase now and I'll show you guys them once I've finished. I went from side to side to tell my trouble come alive. Can't wait the sun is shining If the sails and follow my own tide, yeah and There's a screaming in there Not telling me to leave for a while So for the first time I just in Right on now, I'm gonna ride my own line on I wanna escape and restart all doing a little bit of dusting in my bedroom i thought it needed a little bit of a dust it feels so much better in here now and put things that are kind of going in the attic and that sort of stuff i want to change my bed sheets now as well because i've got fresh bed sheet, uh, bed sheets to put on my bed sort a couple of bags out that i've got just lingering around put a pair of jeans away and then i am ready and my bedroom's all done and it feels much tidier now so i'm gonna quickly do that now make myself feel a little bit better i feel like you know clean just love that love having a nice clean bedroom and i'm glad that i have sorted all of my mirror and my sink and everything out it feels so much better now um yeah and i'm just gonna quickly change my bed sheets now <laughs> I 
finished making my bed. Now, I have missing pillowcases. I have absolutely no idea where they've gone, but I thought I'd go with this. Don't, please don't judge my bed skills. I honestly, I just made my bed, you know what I mean? I don't even really fuss about too much. Not really like a pro bed maker or anything, but I have decided to go with this side because it's double sided so it has like this sort of bluey kind of colour and I thought yeah that side would go with my room but I just feel like a real springy sort of vibe so I thought I'll go with pink this time because I don't usually go with this side and I'm not sure if I'm feeling it with this room or not or whether I should just stick to the other colour you know but I'll see how I feel about it later on. I think the pillowcases must be downstairs, but however, I'm gonna go downstairs. Or I'm gonna get changed for my workout now, and then I'm gonna go downstairs and have a quick drink, get my workout in with Dad, because he's just got home, and I'll catch up with you guys probably tomorrow, I think. But yeah, I hope you guys are all well, and I will speak to you guys shortly. Hello, everybody. So it's now the next day. It's Wednesday. Me and Josh have come to pick up James that we've come early to where James goes to school. There's like a field next to it. So, oh my God, you just saved the, Josh has got a new car. So we're just trying to protect it from the basketball. But basically we are playing a bit of basketball. Yeah, it's really fun. But Josh is gonna show you my awesome skills at basketball. my skills and so out of breath but we're gonna continue playing another one you got it Woo! <laughs> high five <laughs> and I will catch up with you guys later on <laughs> hello everybody or oh, good evening it is nearly 20 to 8 on Thursday the 25th I think it's the 25th anyway literally had the most stressful afternoon with my video that's just gone up which was meant to go up yesterday didn't go up yesterday went up to, and i sort it all out today um by the way i'm sorry if it's really noisy but my brother is having a bath because he literally just fell up the stairs and spilled his food everywhere and really hurt himself so i'm just running him a bath but um but yeah and i've had such a mail with my video but James is just coming upstairs. I've sat in here eating his dinner, his new dinner, whilst he's um, waiting for his bath. Hello, oh dear. Is the sad, sad state of affairs going on? <laughs> Don't worry, I won't show you on here. I'm just filming for my vlog, that's all. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah? Do you want to put some, do you want to put Moana on? Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> enjoy your bath. Um, but yeah, and I had a right mail with my video going up, and I uploaded it, and then I realised that I'd done something wrong, so then I had to take it down and sort it out and export it all again. Oh, it's honestly been such a stressful few hours. So anyway, it is now up, but we are just going to put Moana on for a little bit. I'm going to print off my things ready for mine and Josh's date night tomorrow, um, and yeah, that's just kind of where we're at with today. It's just not been a very good day, is it? A bit of a rubbish one today, so tell me about it. Tell me about it. Definitely has been. So I'm in my pajamas. I feel like my eyes have like just shriveled up because I've been staring at the screen for so long. <laughs> Of my mistakes to only keep it the truth, yeah. 
There's a treasure out there Just everyone should just have to choose, yeah Here it is a wisdom of my say Is that a mark, freedom of mind Is one away James is um, in the bath, so I've popped on the daff. Let me um, turn it down quickly. Right, yeah, I'm watching the daff at the moment. I just thought I would show you. I've literally had the window open today, so all of the like little bits have flown through my window. It's really annoying. So I keep having to like pick them all off my bed, but I just thought I would show you quickly. So I have got my the room for let me turn this down, it's still quite loud. I just thought I'd show you because I've just cut these all out. So this is for our when I put it on the van, the back of the van. So welcome to room one. I just thought it was really cute with the date. There's the invitation that I read out to you guys. Um, and I've obviously popped it all in there and I just feel like it looks so cute. And then I've got our tickets as well. So I've obviously, like I showed you the other day, I picked up the um, cards, which I'm going to write on now for like the movie options. I'm not entirely sure what options I'm going to pick yet. And I'm also going to download them on my laptop so that they're ready because I've got a really busy day tomorrow. Um, so I, yeah, I've done that already. Um, but now I've just got to pick the films. But yeah, I was scrapbooking yesterday as well, and I'm really, really happy because I finally finished my very first scrapbook, which honestly has taken such a long time. It literally goes from 2015 um, all the way to now, obviously, but I've only got up until August last year, so I got to print off a lot more. But yeah, so I'm loving it. I absolutely love doing my scrapbooks. I got some Fantas at the shop the other day, and I thought I'll get Fanta Zero Sugar. Honestly, I think it's so much better than normal Fanta. Is that like really wrong? But I mean, I do love Coke Zero as well. However, I just do like a normal Coke, you know. So yeah, I'm gonna probably pop downstairs. Oh, I don't know though if I can be bothered to get an envelope. I might just take it all downstairs in the morning. Let me show you how my tulips are going on as well. Look how cute they're looking. I'm sorry, but adorable i feel like they just fit my whole spring vibe at the moment also my plant is getting so big i mum sent me these like vases last night and i was like oh my god they're so nice i uh, sorry not vases um plant pots and i was like oh they're so nice but they the ones i actually want to come in a pack of three and i just don't have like any more plants to put them in we don't really have any more around the house it's like literally my only plant and there's one actually downstairs we do have one but it's very small and it's one that we got mum for Mother's Day. Um, and it's so cute, it's got like these little red flowers on. I'll have to show you guys tomorrow if I remember. Um, which is just so cute. But yeah, so that's kind of where we're at with things at the moment. I was going to sit and edit tonight, but I really just think I need a little bit of like crafty sesh going on. Because my eyes feel so like spent. And they are so tired. So... The TV's like far away enough for me because I've literally been staring at a screen like this like all day. That's just killing me. So I need to have a shower. I was going to have a shower tonight as well, but I'm going to do that in the morning. I've got so many things to do tomorrow, guys. I literally am so tired. I feel exhausted and I feel like I haven't really done a lot. It's not going well for me today. So I'm just going to write a list down of things that I need to get done. Um, just so I don't feel so overwhelmed because at the moment I feel really overwhelmed and I, <laughs> I feel like I haven't done enough today to like make sure everything is right for tomorrow and I think I just get really like flustered about it and and I think editing tonight is kind of like when my video didn't go up properly I feel like I just get really stressed about it so I'm going to quickly make my list get in the shower, wash my hair dry my hair once I get out do my face cream and everything and we'll all be good We'll be fine. I want to escape the restart all. Get through the storm.
I'm just about to sort the van out. So I have so far cleaned out the van. I know it still looks a little bit dirty just because it just gets dirty. I've wiped all the damp, but I'm gonna put this in the bottom for like the protection for the covers and stuff so it doesn't get like a little bit dirty, but I have wiped it all down. It's just like really hard mud to get up. So anyway, this is how we're gonna do it. So this is what it looks like at the moment. I cannot wait to transform it, and so you guys can see there's going to be lights all up here, it's going to be amazing, I can't wait. Okay guys, I have put all the pillows and covers and everything in, it looks so much better in person, I feel like the camera is not doing any justice like at all, but it's looking pretty cute so far, I can't wait to show you when all the lights are on and like it's dark, I feel like that's going to capture like the real proper vibe of what I'm going for and I'm gonna have like you'll see all the lights in the top of the van and then have like the laptop and snacks and I've made some obviously like you would have seen I've made some made some cookies so I'm really really excited I can't wait for when Josh comes home and he's gonna pick up the food on the way back I have popped up the lights look how cute this is looking so obviously all the lights will be up there, just ignore that. I had to stick it there because that's the only place I could put it. With all of our covers. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. And all the lights, look how adorable they look. It's a little starry night. Now I'm not really sure whether I'm just gonna stick them up here like that, whether I just want them dangling down. I'm not 100%. I feel like I might stick them up and just see what it looks like. It's Stuck them up the top with just a bit of tape and I feel like that looks much, I know the tape isn't very like nice but we're just going to roll with it but I feel like that looks better and then just kind of see, obviously once all the food and that is in here and once it's like dark it will look so cute but I'm not 100% sure I want to keep them up like that or whether I want them down but I will probably decide whilst I'm gone and just see how I feel about it when it's actually dark when I get back but yeah it's looking so cute and I'm so happy with it oh I can't wait for him to see It is Saturday! It feels like I haven't spoken to you in, for such a long time even though I literally spoke to you guys yesterday. But, um, I hope you liked the date night setup. It was so nice. It did get a little bit chilly. So we did come back inside like a little while after. Not like obviously too long but yeah. Um, it got a little bit chilly but <laughs> it was really really nice. Good morning anyway. It is now... 20 to 9 in the morning. I have been up for such a long time because mum and dad have gone to pick up mum's new car, swapping her car over for a new car. So it's literally just new car central at the moment in our house. So everyone's getting new cars. But yeah, so I just thought I would pop on here and update you guys on what 
kind of has been going on. Um, I've got to go to work, but I will be back really soon because I've only got a very, I've got a really quiet day today, which is nice. However, I hope you guys are all well and you're all staying safe. Um, it is a beautiful day outside today. I'm really hoping it stays like this. The sun is shining, the skies are blue. We're feeling good, we're feeling good today. So yeah, I'm looking forward to having a nice day. I do have editing and that to do, but I'm hoping that me and James will go on a nice dog walk. But my tulips are looking beautiful, guys. Look at them, they are stunning. They are such a spring vibe and I'm absolutely loving them. I just honestly think that they are so cute. So I've got to go and bring out the covers from the back of the van uh, because obviously I've got to go to work for a little bit. But yeah, so James has got to come with me to work. But it's literally only for a couple of hours, so it's fine. Um, but yeah, so that's kind of where we're at for today. I will catch up with you guys later on. Me and James are going to watch a Scooby-Doo movie tonight, uh, today as well. So I'm very excited about that. I'm thinking Scooby-Doo and The Witch's Ghost feeling that one we watched the cyber chase last week because james hasn't seen any of these movies and i absolutely used to love and adore these movies as a child so like the one with the vampire and everything like i'm gonna make sure that we watch them all together so literally it was like eight pounds on sky the other day but i was just like it is so worth it so that's how we are this weekend we're gonna watch another scooby-doo movie have some snacks maybe a fanta and something like that some lunch but yeah i'm looking forward to it so i will catch up with you guys in a little bit Bye. Sunday. Um, I hope you guys have enjoyed the vlog. I know it's been a bit of a long one, but obviously trying to cram in a whole week to a video is tough. So much happens and goes on. It's a bit of a cloudier day today, but I've literally, the clocks went forward this morning. Um, I woke up this morning and I thought it was really early, but it turns out it wasn't. Oops. But yeah, so it's a bit of a cloudier day today. I'm sat downstairs and just actually finishing off today's video um which my laptop has just been an absolute pain so anyway i've been struggling with that this week so i'm just finishing off the video here um, i really hope you guys enjoyed make sure you give me a big thumbs up and subscribe if you are new welcome to the family i am so happy to have you here um yeah and i just really hope you guys enjoyed the big juicy vlog and i will see you guys in the next video bye <laughs>